This is a great question, thank you very much. So chronic dehydration, symptoms of chronic dehydration to start off with, and let me preface this by saying that I'm not giving any medical advice. I'm not um, allowed to do that, but um, would be chronic dehydration would be things like headaches, nausea, foggy head, um, uh, urine that's too dark, lots of um, uh, symptoms that um, yeah are quite easily fixable if you actually um, start drinking your water but it can take a couple of weeks for that to happen so what we would do is but when you've made your booking we would go through um, drinking water to see what you're doing before you're coming in and then encourage you to improve that before you come in that's going to make your clonic more effective um, However, if you're dehydrated, your body is going to absorb some water through the bowel. So as you put the water in, the body's going to go, oh, water, interesting, and just absorb it, basically, um, or certainly some of it, so that we will have less poo coming out because you're actually absorbing through. Your body's trying to hold on to it. So that's why we encourage you to drink some water beforehand. But remember that water needs to be drunk slowly and room temperature. If you're dehydrated, glugging is not going to help you at all. Um, because the gastric system is just going to spasm and potentially push it out. You're going to pee it out. Um, but drink it slowly like a little flower and that will help you with chronic dehydration. Um, but yeah, we'll get less out, unfortunately. And that's why we always speak to you to encourage you to slowly increase water before you come in. Hope that helps. Okay, bye.